Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to Planet Crafter 1.0. We're in Season 5. Today is a major upgrade day because while I was gathering all of that stuff, uh, we actually got the T4 heater as well. We'll have to put in more power to build a T4 heater and we'll also have to go get the stuff to make explosives for it and we might run out of super alloy but let's take a look at the t4 drill because that's what i prepared so the t4 drill does 459 pressure per second the t3 drill does only 17. so we're going to go set up the t4 drills and then we'll move the machine optimizer take down the t3 drills which we have a million of <laughs> and then we will uh, take out all of those and do we get anything back for that nothing really just one iridium rod so that's not going to be hugely helpful we might have to make super alloy all right let's set up where we're gonna do this i think we can do it right here that won't interfere with any of the other machine optimizers. I can only make three. We'll try to make the other two. And let's go get the, our optimizer. It's around here somewhere. Optimizer. Where did you go? It's so loud in here. Oh, we didn't have one. I keep thinking that we have one of those, but we don't. So let's just go look at what we've got. It's the heater we have the optimizer for. Absolutely driving myself crazy. Look at the pressure going now, though. Now the pressure is 83,000. Oh, my goodness. Let's see how much of that heat we can fix. Uh, we need three super alloy each uh, to fix that. So we'll see. <laughs> Let me put all that away because we don't have the sulfur. All right. Uh, why is it so dark? Oh, it's nighttime. Oh, for goodness sake. Wow, look at where we're at. Excuse me. <laughs> I almost didn't mute the mic in time. All right. We have 165 power left. Those take 50 each, so we can only put in three of them, but we need to go get the sulfur. Let me just check and make sure that we need to go get sulfur. Oh, we did put a drill in there. We'll see if it's gotten anywhere, but uh, we need two sulfur for every single one of the explosives for that. <laughs> I keep thinking I have a pressure fuse. Maybe, uh, uh, yeah, maybe we should go try to find one of those after we get these uh, heaters going. What's in there? Yeah, we might need that. I keep forgetting, you know what? I keep forgetting that I've left things out because I didn't need them right away. I do need all this aluminum back. I did not leave this box out, though. Okay, let's go see if there's anything in our drill. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of aluminum in here still. It's crazy. It's also aluminum here in the sulfur field. Three. <laughs> we got three. Let's see if we can find some more. It's, uh, it's super hard to find it here, but you know what? Let's, let's cut this out and go into a place where it's super easy to find sulfur i'm going to start right here the more of this that we can find the more t4 heaters we can put up because we do have like a dozen or more rods that we don't need And we've got really, really a lot of iridium still on the ground because I haven't even really begun uh, to 
to pick it up. I saw something behind me. I don't know what it, what it was. That's iron. I really need to get just a regular drill in, but it looks like the sulfur is working as a regular drill for me because it's picking up uh, all kinds of stuff other than the sulfur that I needed to pick up. Once we get the T3 ore extractor, of course, we'll be able to mine for sulfur anywhere on the map. If you did not know that, uh, it is uh, having the T3 drill that does that. Did I put a HUD in here? I don't think I have yet. No. Okay, well that means the closest air is the crater, so let's go get uh, some air, because I don't think I have any survival stuff on me at all. This uh, blue beacon really serves as a beacon for the entire map. So it's, it's great for everything. There we go. Okay, I think I got all the sulfur uh, out of the uh, that particular ospium cave. And I don't remember if we checked the blue crates in here. I kind of have a vague memory of doing it, but, uh, you know, that could have been a different save. <laughs> the way things are going, there's an other oxygen, oxygen multiplier. Anything we haven't touched, we're going to be in great shape now. Uh, I think it's actually, yeah, it's actually down here. There it is up there. There's uh, one of those and two of those. This is all going to be underwater, so uh, it's a good idea to come in and check these things uh, before the water starts flooding. So before you hit moss stage because the water really rises uh, when you've completed the moss stage. All right, we'll do a quick check for a little bit more. I think I got it all. Yeah, I didn't see any more. That music reminds me of uh, something else, and I can't place it right now. Oh, geez. Maybe we should just uh, stay here for a second. Yeah, I don't have, like, any survival supplies on me. Biomass screen, nice. Uh, what do we need for that? <laughs> Three power, aluminum, iron, and silicon, no problem. This is a regular storm. It's going to bring in some aluminum if I can get to it quickly enough. It lasts about 20, 25 minutes. Or until you leave your game, of course. Every spring I say, this is it. This is the spring that's going to kill me. <laughs> this is our uh, fifth spring on this channel. <laughs> it has only gotten a hundred times worse. <laughs> I think it's like magnitudes of earthquake that it, it's sort of, it's not the next level. It's ten times the next level. Okay, I think we're done with that. One more. There's always one more. <laughs> it's so funny. I really started to question whether or not I had um, these platforms at the right level. And I had put in that stairway, you know, thinking, oh, it's, it's not going to come up any higher. I've, I've passed lake level and started moss. And it sure enough did. <laughs> all right we need some iridium for that we'll just grab all of it see what we can do 
Uh, oops, wrong, wrong station. Yeah, I'm thirsty. Oh, that's what I needed. Oh, one more. There we go. Uh, thirsty, thirsty, water. There we go. Let's grab the rest of the water. There we go. One, two, three, four. We can do four. That in there. One, two, three, four. Put that in there. And then uh, we need uh, the super alloy. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Perfect. Do I have room for the rest? Yep. Yeah. I do have it all right. <laughs> all righty. This is as good a place as any right here. One, two. Oh, I forgot to get the rods. <laughs> I need two rods and one explosive. I've got it backwards again, which means that we can make eight of these, <laughs> not four. <laughs> Take all of the rods and uh, probably way more super alloy. There we go. We're going to have to build another machine optimizer for oxygen, though. All right. Keeping the machine optimizer in the middle. Just because it makes it easier. There goes the power. We'll, we'll get the power going here in just a second. Our next machine optimizer is going to cover the rest of that. And we still have one explosive left. Very good. We need that for the power. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I have the uranium for the power. Nope. Oh my goodness. Uh, let's see here. How much power am I lacking? Uh, we're using 1579. We have 1384. 86 is not going to do it. Darn. We're going to have to take down one of the heaters. <laughs> or all of these. Let's see how many of these we have to take down. They just don't use that much power. Uh, no, it's uh, iron and titanium. <laughs> there we go. <sighs> yeah, they just don't use... It's only 8 power. I'm just trying to get it to a point where I don't have to struggle. Let's see what how much power we need now. Uh, 15, still not there. Oops, wrong box. Here we go. Is that not all fit in there? It did not. I'm always trying to push the limits, you know what I mean? Always and forever. I still have another machine optimizer to put in, too. Uh, okay. Let's put in one of these. Oh, I don't have any super alloy either. Does the other one require that? Only one. That's interesting. Okay, we're going to have to take a heater out. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes, low power. That's, that's what happens when you do too much at one time. That was only 51. I think 
kind of looks like enough. That was a hundred of it right there. Uh, let's see. Oh, we're only 15 or so short. problem. There we go. Now we can go about getting the stuff that we need while that's running. Just running really out of control anyway. Okay, how much is the machine optimizer? It is 50. We have 14. <laughs> we have a problem, people. We need a, we need a rocket. Uh, we need two more cobalts. Here we go. <laughs> I love this game. It's so crazy. Uh, let's see. It tracks uranium asteroids. Let's do it. Remember that first one is going to hit that launch platform, so don't stand up there. Just a nice normal rocket. We don't even need to watch it. It's just going to go to space like a normal rocket. Oh, it, it missed. It just, it missed by just that little tiny bit, too. <laughs> You know what, Kamo? I really need these these meteors to hit the ground here so I can get to the stuff. <laughs> this is playing games I shouldn't be playing. Way over there. Oh my god, one of them's in the drink, isn't it? <laughs> two more no oh no that one went out of reach I don't appreciate that behavior game oh that one went clear over the cliff that's not even okay with me <laughs> oh, <laughs> there's another one under there. Oh, maybe I can slip in right there. Almost. <laughs> I'm trying to trick it into letting me have it. One more in there. All right, we'll have to come back for that one. Hopefully I won't get stuck. All right, how much more went into the water? Look at how low down the algae is. <laughs> it's just hanging down there at the bottom. Uh, nope, that's our pod. I was looking for a light over there, but that's the pod. We might have to send up another one just because they went over the mountain over there. That sucks. Look at that, the whole thing is still there. You don't normally get to see this part. It's usually buried. Can I? No, I can't. <laughs> Can I try anyway? <laughs> I think there's one in the doorway. Maybe we got lucky. Maybe it went through the roof. Maybe it. Maybe it didn't. Oops. Got a little glitch right there. That was weird. There's a gas extractor. It's gonna pile up on us now. There it is. Oh boy. 
Did it land in here by some miracle? Let's get some air. Did I leave any water? No. Oh, I gotta go back anyway. I'm full. Alright. Food and water. And then the hunt for uh, more uh, uranium out here. Looks like one hit over there. So it might be enough. Oh, it just disappeared right before my eyes. As you insist, so shall I do. Okay, there's number two. What else have I got on me? All that iridium. Uh, I've got plenty of explosives and plenty of super alloy now. Because <laughs> I had to take my stuff away. Oh. Alright. Let's see if there was one over there if we got lucky. Over here somewhere. Yes. Perfect. Now we have the power. I was thinking that we would be fine with that amount of power. <laughs> Until we got fusion, but apparently not. Is that nine? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's kind of sad that it, it went over that mountain. It might be in the sulfur area. We could go look. But let's get the power back up. Uh, I just need the water. Oops, wrong door. All right. I could join those two pipes together. They look like they're part of the same thing. <laughs> okay. Oh. My gosh, that did a lot of damage. <laughs> okay, now then. <laughs> uh, we could use to put back in a heater. Uh, I just need the two rods. I think I only left four heaters on that machine optimizer. Oh my god, I really did want to go to the warp gate today. We only have eight minutes. No, I got five there. One, two, three, four, five. All right, this is just extra for when we get the next machine optimizer then. It's such a dreary day now. We still have all those flower spreaders to do. Maybe I should do that for the rest of the day and we'll go to the warp gate next time. Yeah. Uh, don't... Oh, I needed to make another one. Uh, yeah, we got the power. Another one on oxygen. There it is. Oh, we have the power, but we don't have the ability because we don't have the explosive. Alright, put it away. Put it away now. And we will go gather supplies. Here we go. And then all of that. And then I don't think we're going to need the food. We'll take the oxygen and a bottle of water and let's go uh, clear the uh, the drill. I'm really sad about that. Maybe it went into the sulfur field. It didn't look like it. it looked like it hit the, the top of the rocks there where you can never get it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's one. But, oh, I still can't reach it. <laughs> this drill is also completely full, and so is the aluminum drill. But if we can get another sulfur, then we'll be able to make another, um, another explosive. Two more sulfurs. All right. Nope, only one. <laughs> so cruel you are, game. Let's see. It flew over this way, but it didn't land here. Not that I can see, anyway. I don't see it anywhere. Not that it would be inside of a box. 
I can't get through the roof of the uh, Osmium Cave or the Zeolite Cave. Get only through the only through the roof of the Iridium Cave. Uh, I need to pick up some sulfur here, not just ignore all of it. If I can find any. I'm terrible with this. My vision is absolutely horrifying. There we go. Now let's see. There should be around here somewhere. There should be a crate or two that we haven't picked up. Down that canyon and right here. Uh, we don't need that stuff. <laughs> I must have opened that box already. Hmm. I'll take it. We don't really need all that. We need the uranium for sure. Uh, let's see. I think the sulfur ends right here, so... It doesn't go, like, all the way to the edge. There's aluminum. I have enough sulfur to do that one thing. But we didn't have time uh, to do the warp gate today, so I'll just pick this stuff up instead. Sometimes there's a piece of sulfur against this wall. Oxygen's looking pretty sad. Alright, we just gotta wait for the drill. Yep. Oh, I did pick up an oxygen capsule. Good choice. Yeah. <laughs> I need some air. <laughs> All right. I need all of this stuff for building, and it's just piling up here. Oops. I need to clear these drills. All right. Let's go uh, try to make this optimizer. Oh, I can't pick it up now, can I? <laughs> you know what I'm going to be doing between episodes today? I have to pick up all that stuff before I can shut my game down. Oops. Uh, yeah. All right. Uh, we need. Oh God. <laughs> How much is that? One short. Okay. Now this is the part where I start driving myself crazy. Uh, that is a sea light. It's fun to be getting zeolite right now. Uh, orbital information. God, I'd like to launch that rocket. All I need is that that one uranium. I feel so cheated by that meteor going over that mountain like that. I might move that rocket, that launch platform. I think we'll do that right at the end here. As soon as I get this optimizer going, we're going to move this launch pad because that going over the mountain like that is really disappointing. There we go. Uh, nope, I don't have the fuse. There it is. And that. There we go. As if by magic I have the rest of it. Uh, I cannot wait until we get the next uh, optimizer because this is such a waste of material having to use two optimizers because I've got two fuses, you know. All right. Let's uh, check the oxygen and move the launch pad because it's needs to be moved. Oxygen, 28,756. Look at our terraformation index is just flying. That's great. 
That's why they gave us the machine optimizer because it just is such a struggle. I don't know if this is going to work, but we're going to give it a try. See, those mountains interfere too, but you can climb to the top of those mountains. In fact, uh, you can get to the top of those, uh, to the, um, what do you call it, the maze as well. Here we go. We're going to have a storm right now. It doesn't seem very different, but it is different. It's at least quite a few feet different. Oh, it's a real storm. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> We're going to hide in our bio lab where it's safe. Look at that thing hit there again. <laughs> oh my god. All right, you guys. <laughs> oh, darn it. I'm so close. I want to thank you all so very much for coming along. Oh my god, we are definitely going to hit uh, GTI in the next episode. And that comes with all of its own amazing things. Thank you all so much for coming along. I do hope you have a lovely evening. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now. Boom. Yeah, boom. <laughs>